Meanwhile, Delta State Governor Right Honorable Cherry Burberry has urged all companies and host communities to adopt a dialogue approach to resolve disputes, stating that peace is the best solution. He stated he tasked the new leadership of Chevron Nigeria Limited to study operations and build relationships with host communities and stakeholders. Burberry also warned against shutting down oil facilities by host communities and oil companies oppressing the people. Communities who are shut down any of, any of the oil stations. It's something that I will not take. And they, they know I will not take it. I will not also allow the oil companies to also oppress our people. They, they must keep to the every because it's good to keep to it. You know, when you keep to it, it also help. But I want to say the most important thing that will make you to succeed is to engagement. Because you need to do engagement, you know. Uh, these people's parliament, which will be my people, is good. And creates a lot of awareness. Some of these people think they will understand the way they operate. Because when a new government comes in, telling the leadership at the, at the community level, uh, I would not say desperation. I want to see how they can impress the community, uh, how they can get things for their community. And when there are things that are ethical, there are things that are ethical, you may not understand. Engineer Esimaje Brinkins, Senior Corporate Affairs Advisor for Chevron International Exploration and Production for Africa Region, praised Governor Oboroweri for his leadership, community engagement, and efforts to stabilize the region, benefiting Chevron's operations and the state's economy. He noted that Chevron has committed $1.4 billion for an ongoing drilling program in the country. We find that our operations here bring significant revenue to the state by way of taxes. <laughs> but of course, that's, that's secondary. The willingness to ensure that there's always peace to grow it goes beyond whatever revenue that we've got. Because where there is peace, then you can think about expansion. And that is what we continue to enjoy from the kind of support that we get from the Delta State Company, the drilling program. Uh, we have deployed, you know, commitment for the over $1.4 billion for that drilling program. There are very few oil and gas investments at this time in the country that is ongoing. Uh, that program is being funded by third parties, banks, so it's not philanthropic. The bank commitments are clear. You have to meet those obligations. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.